In this video, we will show you how to set up custom contact lists on your management dashboard. We'll start by heading to the communication section and selecting contact lists. From here, we can create a new contact list by selecting the new contact list button in the top right hand corner. From here, we can name this new contact list. So say if we wanted to uh, have all of the men on one contact list, so we'll call this the men's contact list. Next section over, we can add positions to this contact list if we would like. In the next section, we can add positions to this specific contact list if we would like, such as a leader, a co-leader, or coach. For now, we'll leave this blank. The next section down is for the members of this contact list. One section we will want to go ahead and select is the allow provisional membership. This allows members to join and leave your group or your contact list. The section down here at the bottom, we can then go ahead and add group members to this specific contact list. We can select find, and from here, we can actually filter through our contacts to find the contacts we specifically want to add to this contact list. So up in the top right-hand corner, we'll filter, and we'll go ahead and add a condition. From here, we can filter specifically by gender is male to pull up all of the men. We hit apply filter. That'll narrow our field from 45 down to 27. We can go ahead and select all of these and add them to our contact list. The next section is for interested members awaiting approval. If this is a, a section if people have to ask for permission to join a contact list first, they will show up here. The next section down is for metrics for this specific contact list. The last step we will need to do is to hit save up in the top right hand corner.